Is it true love or opportunity? Well, that is a common question when you see couples that sometimes make you cringe. These women may have something to do with the idea that money is what makes the world go round with all of their partner's achievements. After all, it is said that every great man has a great woman behind him. However, we also wonder if these women really love their partners or just extravagant life. Well, you're about to find out more about that through this video. Princess Amira Altawil is regarded as one of the most attractive women in the entire world. She first met her ex-husband, Prince Alwalid bin Talal, when she was just 18 years old. When she was allowed to interview the prince, the two came into contact. The two fell in love right away, and the interview ended up lasting more than two hours. She is well known for her work on behalf of women's rights, philanthropy, and of course, her beauty. The couple wed nine months later. Sadly, the couple got divorced in 2013. But there isn't much information on why they couldn't work things out. Prince Alwalid and Princess Amira still have a good relationship. Although she is no longer a legitimate royal in Saudi Arabia, her new objective is to serve as an inspiration for other strong women all over the world. Before we even understood what a search engine on the internet was, there was Netscape. It was revolutionary at the time, but today, it's mainly just a web browser. And she is Australian model Christy Hinz, the wife of Jim Clark, the man who founded Netscape. Christy has modeled for Victoria's Secret and even appeared on Sports Illustrated. Despite the couple's age differences of 36 years, you would think that love would find a way somehow. In 2009, the couple got married, but they already had other reasons to rejoice. Jim was the only person in history to found three entirely distinct billion-dollar businesses. American billionaire Steve Wynn was interested in Andrea Hism back in 2008, but there was a problem. Steve was already wed to his first wife. But of course, nothing is truly out of reach when you have billions of dollars. Steve eventually married Andrea after divorcing his wife, who received one of the largest divorce settlements in history. The couple wed in 2011, one day after the royal wedding. There were many comparisons between the two occasions. For instance, Andrea's dress was rumored to be very similar to Duchess Kate's dress. Steve even spent $1 million on the wedding, which had 1,000 guests. Fabienne Flozzi and wealthy Bernie Ecclestone have to be among the most odd couples on the list. For those of you who don't know, Bernie is the CEO of Formula One and one of the wealthiest men in the world. This is his third marriage, and there was some drama with it. Many people referred to Fabiana as a gold digger because of their 45-year age gap. But if you see the couple together, you can see their love. Even though Fabiana towers over Bernie and they don't always agree on things. She was the vice president of marketing for the Brazilian Grand Prix before getting married to the British business mogul where she eventually met him. Rumor has it that when she left for the British billionaire, she was dating a Brazilian doctor. Elisabetta Gregoracci, an Italian model and presenter, is yet another surprise addition to the list. Elisabetta wed Flavio Breatore, an Italian businessman and manager of a Formula One team in 2010. Despite having an approximate 30-year age gap, Elisabetta and Flavio were still able to have a child. They have one son together. Sadly, it seems that not everything is perfect in paradise. After nine years of marriage, the couple announced in January 2018 that they had filed for divorce. Although neither was revealed what went wrong in the marriage, it is believed to be a mutual split. It must not be that bad since Elisabetta is reportedly going to receive a huge amount of money as a result of the divorce. You may be asking how much. Well, we don't know. Melanie Kraft a romance author is not the only one of Larry Ellison's wives to appear on this list. 
Larry is best known for founding and leading the software company Oracle. He wed Melanie in 2003, but the couple tragically separated in 2010. The gorgeous Melanie worked a variety of jobs prior to their union. She attempted to become a pastry chef, a safari driver, and a bartender in the past. Unfortunately, the couple wasn't compatible. The age gap of 25 years didn't seem to be a problem. Well, if not the age gap, what could be the problem? Whatever the case, She's reportedly acquired a yacht and several of her ex's properties, and she's doing great after the divorce. Wendy Deng, a successful businesswoman of Chinese descent, is unmatched in her field. Her parents, who are engineers, wanted her to become a doctor when she was born. She later received a scholarship to attend Yale, which was undoubtedly a wonderful consolation. The most notable thing about Wendy is that she frequently makes news for allegedly being a Chinese spy. This is significant because Wendy was formerly wed to Rupert Murdoch, one of the most powerful media moguls in history. If you're familiar with those names, it's probably because Ivanka Trump is the daughter of President Trump and her husband works for him. As a result, you can see that this relationship had her rubbing shoulders with people like Jared Kushner and Ivanka Trump. This might not have been the best move for this couple. Salma Hayek, a well-known actress, married Francois Henry Pinot in 2007. She may be the only wife on this list who doesn't need an introduction. But in fact, you probably didn't even know she was married to a billionaire. If you don't know Francois, just know that you've likely heard of some of the businesses he owns, like Balenciaga and Gucci. In actuality, the couple was initially set up by a former Gucci executive. Before Francois proposed, the two had been dating for 11 months. Salma even had a little bun in the oven at the time, their daughter Valentina. Considering they've lasted for over a decade, we see this couple being in it for the long haul. If Grace Kelly were your mother-in-law, how would you feel? Princess Charlene of Monaco can't relate to this feeling. She never met her legendary in-law, but the similarities between the two women are quite striking. Prince Albert II of Monaco, who is the son of Princess Grace, is a notorious figure married to Princess Charlene. Princess Charlene, a former Olympic swimmer, is 20 years her husband's junior. They were married in 2011. Despite giving birth to twins in 2014, the princess maintains her physique. Princess Charlene, who is now in her 40s, doesn't appear to have aged a bit. Like Princess Grace, she is regarded as a style icon. Since she is a royal, it is safe to assume that she led a pampered life, which is evidenced by her youthful look. So which of these billionaire's wives' beauty stood out the most? Are you really convinced that they were in love with their partners and not just after fame, power, and money? Well, who knows? Let us know your opinion in the comments section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Also, ring the bell icon to stay on top of our latest videos. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.